My wife, Leslie, and I operate Vander Scott Farms here in Kuna, Idaho. It's basically ingrained in our nature. You know, we were raised on the dairy, and from my grandfather milking cows when I was a little boy to, to now, you know, we, we take the, the quality of the milk that we sell very seriously and the health of our cows as well. And the nutritional attributes of it, I think that too. You know, we, we feel like we put out God's perfect food. To produce quality milk here on this farm, I think the most important thing, again, starts back with the cow. We gotta have healthy cows with healthy udders producing, uh, you know, good, good clean milk and uh, fortunately we're able to do that and then on top of that once once we've harvested the milk from the cow we have to have clean equipment and good working order our animals are our livelihood um, if if they're not in good health and if we're not taking the top the best care that we can give them then we're not gonna survive very long in this business um, so some of the things that we do to to take care of our animals are i always have a vet on staff I have a couple of very good veterinarians they're here at least once every other week, if not every week. We formulate rations, we, we talk about it, we have roundtable discussions about how to improve the health of the cows and, and along with that, uh, pr you know, produce milk. So yeah, the nutritionist was here today and we took some samples. Um, we ran some of them through the shaker box to determine what the lengths of the feed were and stuff. And, and uh, you know, we do those things on a pretty much a weekly basis so that we can ascertain what the you know, the, the levels of the feed are, what the quality is, and make sure we're putting out quality feed in front of the cows so that they can, you know, produce quality milk. And, and uh, we, we take that real seriously. It goes back to the health of the cow and our, and our production. And so we, uh, we do that. We're doing that all the time, but especially during harvest time, we're taking a lot of feed samples and, and running them through the lab. So.